Hi guys, I'm Medina from MK Kids Interiors. I am the main interior designer and founder of MK Kids. Today we're in Heidi's room. She decided that she wanted a blue room. The initial design that I did for her was quite pastel-y um, with soft blues and lots of white. She said blue and white. Uh, then she decided that no, it was too pastel it was too neat. And Heidi is a bit of a cheeky prankster, as you can see, <laughs> worn. So she wanted dark, bold blues and bold, chunky furniture. And so on this project, she helped with the design and chose pretty much the furniture pieces that you see in here and having the feature wall of one blue. So. Let's take you through Heidi's room. So this is Drawing Room Blue by Farrow and Ball. And here we decided to put a vinyl wall sticker, Cheeky Prankster, because she is a cheeky prankster. And the blinds we did were roller blinds because, and they're blackout also, roller blinds with a band at the bottom. So I didn't want to just do a plain Jane roller blind but we added something quite nice at the bottom of the band. The wall art that you see in the corner is, is actually Heidi's wall art. She had that before, so we decided to keep that and have it hung. And the rug, the rug was something that she chose. She actually likes the texture of this rug and it's also washable. That was to her specification. Also, she wanted under bed storage, which are these. They're on the wheels so they can be pulled out. And they were actually um, an IKEA hat. So I got the, the drawers in IKEA and we put wheels on. I painted the front and fitted the drawers with felt so it's quite soft to fill and she could use that as um, additional storage in her room. Anybody wants to do an IKEA hack, that's an idea. She actually chose the bed linen that you see. And the desk, I gave her the option of two desks. This, as well as a retro, a retro looking desk. And she said that she preferred this desk because it looks more stable. <laughs> and the shell was here before and we just decided to paint it the same colour as a wall, which is the Farron Ball Drawing Blue, Drawing Room Blue. She wanted a whiteboard and I decided that it would be nice if she could have a magnetic whiteboard so that she can also stick things onto, as well as write. She decided that she wanted a chest, which is down here, so that she can hide all the things that are really dear to her. I don't want to expose her secrets too much, but she can hide lots of things in this chest, which she actually chose. This is um, an IKEA chest and wardrobe. And the wardrobe, she's moved in. She's moved in, nicely. So as you probably have seen, we decided to keep the, the wooden frames and the skirting just plain because they have lots of equipment coming in and they didn't want to damage the paint. So we decided to just keep it as it is and it works well. <laughs> this unit was here before. Um, Heidi likes to um, find her clothes and things by colour. She's on the autistic spectrum, I didn't mention that. Heidi's on the autistic spectrum, so that helps her to find the things that she's put away. And everything actually had to be to her specification. Because, as Mummy said, autism is not forgiving. So, here we are in Heidi's room, and thanks for watching. If... <laughs> Sorry? 
was going to say, okay, I'll see you in the next project. That's oh. what I was going to say. <laughs> oh, yeah, see you on the next project. <laughs> oh, and if you want to find me, you can find me on um, www.mkkidsinteriors.com. I'm also MK Kids Interiors on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, uh, Pinterest, I believe it's MK Interiors. So check me out, MK Kids Interiors on all the social media sites. No, you can. You can do whatever you want. Actually, you can. Because it's running, but I'll obviously cut it. Oh. Hi! <laughs> Doesn't seem to be very focused too much. He told me to start whenever I want and it's not even focused. Joseph. Why Joseph? Um... You can see people calling me from your watch. <laughs> really? <laughs>